What's up guys, Graham Crackers here with my first home front commentary. Now this is probably going to be my only uh, home front commentary, but I'm definitely going to post more gameplays and maybe even a montage later. So in this commentary I'm going to talk about uh, how I like to play the game, you know, what weapons I use, the perks and vehicles and purchasables I like to use in game, and also the tactics I, I use and the tactics that you should be using too. And then also my opinions of, of home front so I can give you guys a, an idea of whether or not you should buy it based on the pros and cons. As far as the weapons I like to use, uh, my favorite assault rifle is the ACR rifle. Uh, it, it, it's, it's got medium damage and medium firing rate, so it's kind of balanced in that sense. My favorite SMG is the PWS Diablo SMG. Uh, it's got a very high rate of fire and uh, moderate damage compared to the other SMG. My fi two favorite attachments are the silencer and the ACOG scope. The silencer is good for flanking because it keeps you off the map when you fire. And the ACOG scope gives you a lot of extra precision when you're trying to acquire targets at a higher distance. And it's also, it works just fine when you're at a closer range too, especially if you have quick draw. The purchasables I like to use are the Wolverine drone because it's very fast and maneuverable. It also can do a moderate amount of damage against foot soldiers. Uh, the proximity launcher when I can. It's very good against uh, ground vehicles and air vehicles alike and especially against air vehicles because you only have to aim in, the, in their general area and it will do damage. And then when I get enough points I use the phosphorus strike because it's got a very high damage radius and it's almost a guaranteed kill every time you use it. As far as the tactics I use and I recommend you guys use these too uh, I try to keep moving as much as I can because I know that snipers will not be able to shoot me as easily. When I want to move up to get closer to the enemy, I always keep potential cover in mind in case someone starts firing at me. I also I avoid wide open expanses such as you know roads with it without any cover because snipers target those areas a lot and it's very easy for them to get a kill if there is no cover. If there is a vehicle, I tend to stay out of sight until it gets eliminated. When in the helicopter, vehicles take priority and also uh, enemies who are trying to shoot at you. But enemy helicopters usually have a harder time getting rid of you than you think. Um, and I kind of made that mistake where I tried to shoot down an enemy helicopter and wasn't paying attention and got shot by an APC. As far as the gameplay goes, it's a COD clone. It's got insta-hit bullets. Uh, it's very fast-paced. A few bullets to kill, which gives the person with the quickest reaction time an advantage. And it also causes people who are not paying attention to have a higher chance of death. Unlike in Battlefield, where you can j basically just spin around and shoot the other person and have some sort of chance of survival. The movement in this game is very good. You can sprint forward, and you can also kind of sprint to the side, which gives the player added maneuverability. You can also go prone, which gives the player a higher chance of survival. When under fire, they can duck under more types of cover and not get hit. However, the vehicles in this game were kind of lacking. The Humvee is made out of cardboard, because I shot it with an SMG once and it blew up. Um, that's a problem. The helicopters aren't done very well either. Uh, you can literally aim straight down and they won't, they won't fall and hit the ground. But then again when you like roll to the side they just drop and hit stuff and they also they can't fly very fast forward which makes it easy for people with rocket launchers and people with vehicles to shoot you down but everything else is pretty good the sound is pretty good and the graphics are amazing because it's in the unreal engine everything done in the unreal engine looks amazing so i would definitely say that the pros in this game outweigh the cons I hope you guys have enjoyed this commentary. Uh, I'll let you watch the rest of the video, and I'll see you guys later.
Attention, you are receiving enemy fire. Enemy helicopter has been spotted in your sector. Missile launched. Enemy helicopter has entered your sector. Enemy chopper spotted! Enemy vehicle detected! Enemy vehicle taken out! Hang out! Hostile neutralized! Enemy LAV spotted!